Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick. We are back on the Dark Souls 3, and we are going to be starting up the Undead Settlement. Um, not a whole lot that I want to do here, but we will get some stuff accomplished. There's not like a whole... I guess I'll go find the Sunlight Covenant. Uh, other than that, there's not a whole lot here that I need to do. Go kill the dogs, and we'll get our we'll get uh, the sorcerer. I will draw out my strength from him. I'm not going to be doing that quest line in this playthrough, but I will grab the uh, the free levels from him. The bone. <laughs> Please grant me death. Undo my shackles. <laughs> Oh. Oh, then it's true. A champion of ash as I live and breathe. To be in your presence is a great honor. I am Yol of Londor, a pilgrim as you can see, only somehow I failed to die as was ordained. Well, perhaps my calling lies elsewhere. Say, champion of ash, how does the idea of taking me into your service strike you? I was once a sorcerer. Surely I can be of use. Oh, I am honored, truly. I should be dead, yet you have granted me purpose anew. I, Yol of Londor, do solemnly swear myself to you. Alright, so we got Yol now. I'll try to get all the NPCs that I know where they are. I don't know where one of the Pyromancers are. Okay, F you, dog. The dogs aren't even killing these random hollows out here. Okay, why are you guys all going for me? Like, F off. Okay, dogs are going to be so annoying with this great sword. Light this bad boy up. Guess I'll rest. Reset the enemies. There's not night about here, right? No. Alright, here we go. I'm still one shot, people. Rubbish. Small leather shield. I forget a lot of the items here and what they are. Uh, let's grab that. Charcoal pine bundle. I think they might have fixed that guy where he used to not come out if you didn't move to the right location and the right distance away. Let me see if I can still do this. Nope, it didn't work this time. Um, oh god! Oh my god, where the fuck did you come from? Alright, come over here. What is this idiot doing? Come here. How- where the hell did he come from? There we go. Just lob these pre aimed to my location that I want them. Firebomb. Got over here. Soul of an Intrepid Hero. So we just got souls of different names that give crap amount of souls now. It's kind of weird. It's alright, I don't care, but it's a little weird. I think there's a chest in here that I missed. Maybe it's just a couple items. Charcoal. Oh, it's just a charcoal pine bundle. I don't see anything else. All right, let's go. I guess I'll go buy, or I'll go grab this over here. I'm not gonna kill everything, but I'll grab the Estus shard. Okay, Ember. 
And let's wrap around here. F you guys, F off. I'm gonna try to cuss less in this playthrough. Oops, that's not what I wanted to do. Okay, we've got trap in here. I'm just gonna go grab this item anyway. It's like a, the most useless trap now that you've played the game. Well, also, New Game, even if you didn't know that was a trap, on New Game Plus, those enemies are so weak, it doesn't even matter. I might hop in, I'm gonna hop in the dude's cage. How do you, where do you do that at? I actually think I went too far. I think you go... You try this. I didn't do it in my first playthrough because I didn't know about it, but I do now, so... Let me figure this out. Actually, I think you go around here. Yeah, you go around here. How did I miss? Okay, and then... God, these guys are so hard to hit with this sword. And it doesn't help that I have these dickweeds shooting crap at me. Die. Chug. Where is this? I don't even know where it is. Or where the guy is. Is he down here? No, what the heck is the point of down here? There's nothing here. Alrighty. Um. Okay, so if you go around here, here's this thing that tells you you need to hop into that guy's cage. I don't actually know his point other than that. Okay, I can't actually jump onto that. Let me heal before I get blow darted to death. F you! I hate these stupid oh shit so much. Die. Okay, where is Cage, dude? Is he over here? I think he's over here. Yep, there he is. Is he hostile? Alright, here we go. I think I missed, I think there's an item back here that I missed. I'll have to reset where I was, so I'll run back over here. So if you can't tell, this is the area under the the great the tree, the tree boss. All right, so now we can join this covenant. Let me grab this item first. War God wooden shield. Well, what's up? This pit is for hollows. Not for the likes of you, sane folk. Or perhaps you are a hollow, posing as otherwise? Oh, yes, yes, then we are just fine. It's important to know who you are. But we'll all be mad soon enough. And should you be undead, well, all the more so. Beware, the shackles of the gods are fragile. You might need this. Etch it on your heart if you feel your sanity slipping. The Mound Maker's Covenant. Come here to pile up your victims, for that will form your anchor. You'll see when you go mad. They'll be your family. <laughs> 
You'll go mad. Take my... This okay. pit is for hollows. You. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks. I'll oh, pray at the sacrificial altar. Oh, so this is the covenant that deals with vertebra shackles. Okay, I think we just have to homework bone out of here. Go back to the last bonfire we rested at. actually making good time on this episode. Might actually be able to clear the whole area here and maybe get ready to fight. I don't think I'll fight the tree in this episode. I don't think it'll get to that, but we'll get close. I might use some hexes with Artorias since he was consumed by the dark in Dark Souls 1. I might, might go ahead and do that, or I might keep it as a pure Artorias and just not dick around with anything else except his sword and his armor. I have a shield, I don't know what shield I'm gonna use, because if you listen to, like, lore and stuff like that, you do all, listen and watch all that stuff, um, Artorias had a great shield, but when he got consumed by the chaos, he, you know, his arm broker was unusable, so he didn't use his, he didn't use his great shield anymore. Hey, buddy. Why does that guy like camp and wait? Wow, why are you not taking one kill of them? Okay. Um, I'm gonna go this. Ah, oh, shit, I messed it up. Do I even want to. I'm not even gonna dick with that item. Okay, so first of all, we're gonna come over here and grab this item. Soul of an intrepid hero. Now we're gonna drop down here. Oh, you dick. This is an area that I didn't really go to on my first playthrough. F off, I'm not getting gravity here. Come here. The bonfire over here. Let me go light it before I die to gravity. I don't know really how I missed this bonfire in my first playthrough. Other than the fact that I was stupid and I forgot to drop down here. Oh, pot dude. Hey, pot dude. Okay, give him gravity. He didn't die. Oh, he did die. Okay. I didn't think he died for a second there. I don't need to rest. Where am I in relationship to everything? I don't even know where I am. No, though, that I do want to come up here. I love that I still one-shot people, because this is great. It's going to not be as fun when I don't one-shot everything. Ah, here we go. Aha! Unkindled, are we? Welcome to my abode. I am Cornix, an old pyromancer. A crow in his cage, as you see now. But here we are, an encounter for the ages. <laughs> I hear the unkindled make for fine vessels. Care to learn some pyromances from this old man? Ah, most wise. A chance encounter should not be squandered. To reiterate, I am Cornix of the Great Swamp. The pleasure is mine. <laughs> Thanks, Cornix. Hand X. So that's one Pyromancer. I believe there are two Pyromancers in the game that you need to find. I don't know where the second one is. I know where he is, but that doesn't really help me with the second one. Okay, don't need... Actually, there is an item bag here. So we'll go check it out. Oh, no, wait. Never mind. There's not an item there. What am I smoking? Okay, now... What the hell has happened to my game? Yeah, for freezing! What the hell, game? Come on, Xbox One. You can do it. Oh, they quit me out. Oh, I killed it. It died. Son of a bitch. Where is it going to reset me to? Great job, Xbox One. Why the hell did it do that? I more think this is a problem with my personal Xbox One opposed to, like, Xbox One in general. Because my Xbox One does this, like, all the time. 
but it does it hasn't done it, done it with Dark Souls. It usually does it with like usually does it with like online games. Um because it didn't do it in Quantum Break. You it does it so it, the game that it does it most in is like downloaded games. It does better with disc games for whatever reason. You'd think it'd be the other way around. Yeah, I know that I didn't quit the way you wanted me to. I hate how it gives you that message. Like, I know you don't want me to quit by just pulling the plug on the on the game. You want me to save and quit, but that's not always how it goes with this game. I've had to do that multiple times, like, just kill the game, like, hit the center butter button and quit, because so it, it, there's just a lot of issues with some of the parts of this game. Especially with summoning and invading. There are some big issues with that. Okay, we're not that far back. Oh god, I just fell off. We're good. That's eh, not too bad of uh, getting a reset here. I just want to come down here. Over here. Good, we gotta deal with these rats. I can't hit this rat! Just die! Where's the big one? There he is, come here. Blood bite ring. There's the ladder. Just gonna go grab this bonfire real quick. I could just not go and get the dude's help. Actually, I don't even think I need it. I might not. Eh, we will, and then I'll take the other path that leads that way. Guess we'll do this a little bit thorough. Didn't really want to do it thorough, but we will. I need to go back and give well, give Andre my Estus Fly shard so I can have 15 Estus Flies. Can be done with that. Like I'll still grab Estus Flash shards and all of that different stuff, but they're not gonna do me any good. Good Ember. The item over there is pointless, I think, if I remember correctly. I'm not even gonna mess with him right now until we get that key after we get the ashes. Alright. Alright. Are you gonna make me fight you? Why did I kick there? What the hell, game? Why did I kick? Why am I coming out of that animation? Sigurd, what are you doing, buddy? Die. Yeah. You know what? You're not getting away that easy. Come here. And you're dead. Alright. Pardon me, I was absorbed in thought. I am Siegbert of Katarina. To be honest, I'm in a bit of a pickle. Have you ever walked near a white birch only to be struck by a great arrow? Well, if I'm not mistaken, they come from this tower. Whoever it is, I'm sure I can talk some sense into them. But I have to find a way up. And that's just the trouble. This lift only goes down, you see, and... Uh, well, that doesn't get me anywhere. Hmm. Hmm. This lift only... Okay, I get it. Let me go down first. I want to grab that bonfire. And I'll kill the Frost Knight. But I want to get the bonfire most importantly. So that I don't have to run all the way over here and go down that lift when I'm all set to go. Alright, let's go. And 
injured it. Wow! Get wrecked! Oh my gosh, this this sword is actually a lot better than I thought it would be because I didn't think it'd be that great because I don't have a high dex or strength so the scaling isn't really that good on it. But, oh my god, this thing is wrecking early. Yeah, I can rest here. Alright, I don't know if I have a white... Do I even have a white birch? I don't think I do. No, I don't. I don't have a white birch. So I'm not going to be able to become friends with him, I don't think. But we'll give it a try. Nothing else. There's not, like, a ton of crap that I need there. Obviously, I'll pick all of it up, but there's not really anything that I'm in dire need of picking up. Here we go. Send that down. Take this one up. Hmm. I don't, yeah, because I don't think I'm going to be able to become friends with this guy, because I think you need the white birch. It's not a big deal. He doesn't really... He'll do a chunk of damage here, but I don't think it'll be too bad. I really am surprised they didn't put an item up here. Like, this was a perfect place for an item. All right. Who are you? I help any time. I help any time. See, he says that, but he said that last time and that didn't end well for me. Which side do you roll off on? That's right here. Hmm. Any items? Here we go. Oh, life ring plus one. Nice. I'm not even wearing that life ring, so I don't even need that yet. Hmm. Hmm. Ah. Oh. Don't disappear like that. You had me downright worried. But thanks to you, an epiphany has struck me square in the head. I've unraveled the riddle of this inscrutable lift. <laughs> On some days, I begin to doubt myself. I went up the tower, so I thought, then somehow ended up here. I'm not exactly sure what happened. Anyhow, do you see that? That humongous beast? I'm no coward and I've a steady hand, but how now? Think twice before you go down that road. I could try talking some sense in... Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Let's go fight him. Grab this item. Homeward bone. Alright, demon. Let's go. Come and get it. What are... Okay, let's dance. Oh. You've got force, and Sigurd didn't no, even... you should have waited! Well, it's too late now. I, Sigurd of the Knights of Katarina, fight by your side! Sigurd, you deal like no damage. What the... I can't... <laughs> the hell is happening? There we go, Fire Gem, decent chunk of souls. That was quite a performance. But you mustn't get in over your head. We unkindled must put our duties first. But, for the moment, we've a toast to make. Yeah, Siegbra. I gotta get up, I can't do Your valor, my sword, and our victory together. Long may the sun shine! <laughs> what happens if I toast? 
Yeah. Well, I'm going to have myself a little nap. The only thing to do, really, after a nice toast. <laughs> Alright, let's head on out. Grab these items real quick. I guess we'll finish up this area, except for killing the Cursed Rotted Greatwood. Other than that, we'll clear all of this out. We'll finish this area. The heck is the point of that? There are some things that they put in this game that I'm just like, why? You spent time doing that? I could have had another boss if they take out. They could have had another boss or two if they took out some of the pointless stuff they added, like that wrap around right there. I missed. I hate hitting these things out of the air. There we go. I don't even think this is anything. Oh, it's a pale tongue. Never mind. That is worth it. So that is for the Rosaria Fingers Covenant, and it also resets your stats. Northern armor and. Eh. Okay, so this episode will probably be a little bit longer, but that's alright, we'll finish this area. We'll get all the way up to where we need to go get the boss. Okay, yeah, these things can drop down, whatever, I don't care. You guys don't worry me at all. Um, items... Oh, we've got dogs. Is this a... I'm gonna guess this is not a... I guess this isn't a mimic yet. Oh god, F you guys. I hate those stupid... Okay. My stamina back. Okay, never mind. Never mind. Not interested in fighting you guys. Stop being locked on! My character would stop being locked on. Alright, items... What are we looking at? We got this. We got Flynn's Ring, and I believe that's the only item up here. So now we can fall down here. And then fall down here. We got Homeward Bones. And that is it. Okay, so now we have to drop, right? There isn't a ladder. Nope. we got in here mirror set that's a nice that's one of the, it's a decent set it's a decent looking set for the beginning of the game i actually don't think there are any items up here no there's not show gone up Kill that dog, grab this item. Alright, so now we can homeward bone to the last bonfire. I'm gonna need to like go back to the very, very beginning area to do this, because we'll go ahead and do the run, as well as like grab the sunlight covenant. There's a couple things we need to grab. Actually forget where the sunlight covenant is, but we'll find it. So this episode will probably be 40-ish minutes. Maybe 50, I don't know. I got about 12 minutes. Alright, Dark Souls 3 loading screens. Let's go. There we go. Oh, Rota Sacrifice is the last one I rested at. That's not where I want to be. So take me back to this bonfire. Alright, so we just have to do a quick run-through, and then we should be good. I don't think there's too much I need to do. There's just the one path, right? If I'm thinking correctly, there's just the one path. Now, I could be wrong, but I don't think I am. Alright, from this area... Yeah, whatever, pitchfork, dude. I don't care. Got almost 150k souls. Should probably go spend these. 
I'll probably wait until after I've killed Curse Lot at Great Wood to do anything. Yeah, we got an item up here. Let me grab this. I think this is a yeah Titanite shard. This way, I'm gonna actually need to kill these guys, and I missed. Out. Quick chug. I can't open this right yet. But. Soul of Proud Paladin. Right. I think it's over here. Oh god, F you. Right here. I want to drop down. Guess I'll drink the Estes soup. Is there anything else in this room? No. Pop this bad boy open. Actually, somewhere in here is the Sunlight Covenant, but uh, maybe I already have it joined, so I don't have to. Yeah, I don't have to find it again. Whoa, dude! All right, red eyes, what you doing? Oh God, he canceled my. What the hell? What the hell is happening here? Would you just die? I wanted to use the charge attack. I thought I heard it, something walking behind me. Alright, nothing. Item in here. Well, it's an enemy. I think there's, yeah, there's two enemies in here. Whip. I've actually never seen anybody use the whip in this game yet. So it might be godly, but no one knows because no one's using it. Have you hammer, dude? Let me come up here and kill Fatty. Hey, Fatty. Oh, I got hugged. Alright, let me go, fatty. I don't even care that I got hooked. Shuck up! Oh, you, you dick, I can't see. Yep, yep, just fall off at this point. Oh my god! What the fuck is happening? Everybody just died. Alright. Grab this item back. Oh, uh, not an item back here. No, there's not an item back here. I'm stupid. All right, Hodrick. Let's go, buddy. Actually, I want to kill this thing first. Hodrick, if you want to be a dick, go ahead. I don't care. I don't even care. All right, Hodrick, come back here by the bonfire and we'll fight. Come on, Hodrick. Oh well, yeah, I can get my weapon art ready too. Oh, Hodrick. Get wrecked, Hodrick. Oh, I... Oh, he's going power within. Oh, you don't have any Estes left. Oh, you're... You little dick. Using warmth. You little shit. I can't get an attack off. Yeah, die, Hodrick. The tech actually is kind of useful. Ah, warmth. Vertebra shackle. I don't really need warmth. Um, let's go grab this bonfire. Yeah, this video is going to be about 40 minutes by the time I run through this area and grab all these items. I think he's going to be hostile still, those arrows, because I think you need to give him the white birch branches or whatever. If you don't give him that, I think he's hot. That's what makes him hostile. Actually, haven't even done any, like, research towards that. He's not even shooting at me, so I don't even know yet. Soul of a Proud Paladin. Fading Soul. Ember. Well, we're gonna find out here because we're all clustered. Okay. Well, I rolled away. 
I, okay, maybe I he is friendly right now. I don't know. Would you shoot again? Just shoot again. I want to know. Shoot at us. Come on. Oh, yeah, he is friendly. Huh. Well, what the hell is the difference between what I did right there and what I did in my very first playthrough? Workers' trousers? Oh, are those new? Because I don't remember picking those up there. Okay, I'm gonna aggro everybody from here. Actually, I'm just gonna kill you on my own. Here, come out here, red eyes. Get hit by the archer. It's the enemy that drops. Is he coming? Like, like, what are you doing? Go. Got cleric set. Oh, this should be Mortician's Ashes, yep. Did he finally kill Red Eyes? Okay, no item in here. I think there's the scythe over here, I guess I'll grab it. Yep, great scythe. And I guess, you know what, let's just fight the stupid Great Wood in this episode. I should be able to kill him first try. Alright, I don't think I need this open, but I will open it. Okay, so this episode will be like 45 minutes, probably. Because I'll go back and level up and do all that crap after this. Okay, I don't even think I'm going to dick with fighting the enemies. I'm just gonna run up and start hitting that front ball sack. I want this. Alright, come on. Ah, this is the one annoying thing is that. What do I have to hit this ball sack with? This is ridiculous. There's ball sack. I might hit that. Okay, that'll kill all the other enemies that aren't me and the first round of Greatwood. He's almost dead. And I missed that in there. No, I got grabbed. You stupid first rotting great wood. Would your ball sack just please break? And now he's spinning around us. What are you doing? Come here. How many lives does this ball sack have? I hit it like ten times. Right here. Oh my god, stop doing your stupid attacks. Come here. Stop with the hand. Get your ball sack back down here. Thank you. Oh, you're not even dead. Um. Need another ball sack. That ball sack is like really hard to hit right here. There we go. dead now. And there goes the tree. Victory! Yeah! Transposing killed and soul of the rotted great wood. And here's the mound maker's guy dead. Well, that's our nice little bonfire here. We've got 211,000 souls. Let's head back to Firelink, level up, and call it an episode. Not bad progress for one episode. Complete the whole area. So I'm hoping that's kind of how this is gonna go. Not, not too hard, not too easy, but not too difficult. Just a nice little 
run through of the game with the Artorias of the Abyss cosplay. I'm liking these great. I'm liking the great sword. I don't like it for fighting the basic bitch enemies, but I do like it for fighting bosses and the stronger enemies. Uh, it's kind of the trade-off that you make. Okay. Souls. Let's go ahead and pop these. Somehow I missed the twinkling. I don't know how I did it on accident. I missed the twinkling dragon headstone, so I'm gonna have to get that when we get there. I'm not gonna mess with any of the uh, any of the boss souls right now. I don't need. I can't use any of the weapons, so I might as well just wait until the end of the game to get boss weapons and spells. Okay, I'm gonna go give Andre this last Estes shard. Well, a newcomer, I see. I am Andre. I serve at this shrine as a humble smith. Forging weapons. You're in search of the Lords of Cinder, I trust. A toilsome journey, I'd wager. You'll require good arms. Let me smith your weapons. I am a smith. Such is my purpose. Okay, reinforce this. There we go. Fifteen and one. And Ultimate Estus. Reinforce Estus to the highest level. Prithee, be careful. I yeah. don't want... Yeah, prithee, be careful. Whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, hello, you're back. And in one piece. Well, now it's time I do my part. Whatever trinket you need, speak up. Just don't ask me where I got them. Do you have anything? Okay, let me buy these. All right, let's give him the bone. Heavens, she was already dead. Thank you. I'm not surprised though. Almost a relief, really. You can keep the ring, as well, a little trinket of thanks, I suppose. <laughs> Well, thank you. Goodbye. Yeah, I'll stay safe. Give me free levels, buddy. Oh, our champion of ash. Welcome home. This pilgrim, with a debt in death, hardly deserves to behold this divine flame. And I never would have had you not taken me into your service. I thank you dearly for this, and assure you of my leal service. Okay, be on. safe. I'll be back, homie, to draw out my true strength, but I want to level up first. That makes sense. It costs less souls now. Might as well not get... bump the level up even more. Okay. Yeah, we've Gosh, talked to you way too much. <laughs> That I don't need to talk to you anymore. Gracious, yeah, we know you like nourishment and all of that trash. Let me buy all of these. Okay, anything else that I need? I need the key. Actually, I'll get both keys, I guess. We'll get the tower key, too. Okay. Ashen Thank one. you. Huh. Yeah, Ash and one, bring you more Welcome, I'm idle to this. Yeah, I know who you are. Take... We've heard these two women's dialogue way too much. I don't need it anymore. Um, I can only get two levels up, right? Yeah. I'm just gonna pump them into vigor. Let's get vigor to level. Let's get vigor to fifty. Farewell, Ashen One. We'll just go ahead and get vigor to fifty here, and then I'll start working on other stats. All right, buddy. Let's. Uh. What items do you have? You just have spells that I don't really and need. And shall we begin? Bearer of the dark sign, let your true strength shine. Give me that. Be safe, champion of ash. 
Okay, I'm going to kill myself a bunch of times off camera so I can draw out my strength the full times that we need. I'll just draw them out and I'll show you guys in the next episode that it's into Vigor. That's where we're putting those points into Vigor. Um, should have the hollowing thing now here. Oh, no, we don't. We actually don't have the hollowing thing. But I still have a dark sigil, right? I pick... Where does the dark sigil go? I actually don't even know how this works because I haven't done it before. Going to key items. Yeah, there we go. Dark Sigil accumulates curse. Well, eventually, after what's her face shows up, uh, we'll cure the Dark Sigils with her. But that's going to do it for this episode, guys. Hope you guys are enjoying the Artorias of the Abyss cosplay playthrough. Uh, let me know if there's anything I need to do to make this better. Uh, but I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Peace out.